you've been considering the price of loan for, for years. You know, we talked a year ago and you thought it was close. Are you under political pressure not to give price no, of no, loan? No, we're, we're, we're looking at the loan and its merits. We're working with Chrysler. We're thinking to talk to Chrysler. And there are pressures for and against, but, you know, in the end, we, you know, we have to look at uh, what the statute says. We have to look at what we think would be good for uh, America's workers, we, what would be good for the American car industry, and, and we're going to do what we were charged to do. So it was just a coincidence that the politicians were here but not at Ford and GM? That was a coincidence. Do you think you could get it wrapped up, though, within the next I, months? I don't, or is this? No, I, uh, we'll see, but you know, we're continuing to work with them. I, I, you know, Chrysler, with the others, have bounced back from the market. I mean, look, Chrysler has a the last couple of months is the biggest thing this, this last year is the biggest right. increase in sales relative, relative, in relative sales. And they're coming up with exciting new cars. And, and, uh, and they're making this transition. It was primarily an SUV and a uh, light pickup truck coming in, and they're making this transition uh, to also selling cars, which I think is great. So so, most of the market will be in cars. Does it matter that they're no longer a U.S. Uh, owned company? They make the cars in the United States. They're American jobs in the United States. Uh, uh, and so I think, uh, you know, it, it, it's a partnership between uh, Fiat and Chrysler. Are you disappointed you haven't been able to get more of the money out of the 136 program? You just, the Severstall loan is not going to go forward? Well, I think, look, we, again, we, have, we look at all the loans on their merits, and we, and we, try, we, we have to look at it for the taxpayer money as we, as we want to help uh, with American industry and, of course, put Americans back to work. So, so, yes, we want to do those things, but we also have to make sure that we have to look out after taxpayer money. So, so we do all these things. And, uh, and that was the issue in Severstall that you just I, I, You know, it's, it, again, we look on all these loans as having to do with, uh, you know, the risk to the taxpayer, uh, the risk of loans, and, and, and what the ecosystem is doing. And so... So, so it's we, not cylinders making you gun shy about giving Chrysler and these other companies loans. Well, we have to. We have to look at you know. There, the cylinder was an unfortunate thing only because uh, there was no there there in what was being charged. And I think you know, as this has played out, uh, there's a realization of that. Uh, and so we know that. And so we're going to have to go forward and, and just go back to. Uh, executing on the program as it was done. You want to look out after tax interest, but you also want to uh, make loans that will drive innovation in the United States and create jobs in the United States. And that's why Chrysler would seem like a natural loan that's for right. your loans. And so, so and that's why we don't really care if fifty eight percent is own, you know, from Fiat. It is an American slash Italian company, it's an international company, but the jobs being created are in the United States.